Hey, what is up guys? Big Bass Production here. And as you've seen by the title of this video, you'll obviously know what I'm gonna do. And yes, I'm gonna show you how to remove that uh, demo mode annoying words in the middle when you export a file on ScreenFlow um, that is the free uh, trial version. But before I start, I want to just say, uh, give out a message, uh, and the message is, on July 6th, I may not no long, whoops, <laughs> I may not no longer be able to, um, upload any videos, for now, at least, uh, as far as I know, because I will lose internet connection or internet access, um, so I won't. I won't be able to actually interact with my um, with my YouTube. I hope you understand. Please do not unsubscribe. I've worked so hard for y'all you to for all of you to come as one and watch my videos. I hope you will like them, and I hope you find this video useful. Okay, so for first, what you want to do is you're obviously gonna have to record your video. I've already recorded this. See, hello, welcome to Screenful Five. Thank you for downloading and evaluating ScreenFlow. The application is fully functional, but, but will watermark any documents you export. If you decide to purchase ScreenFlow, you will be able to export your your saved documents without the watermark. Um, so it's either it's a hundred dollars you can purchase it, but why purchase it when you could do what I'm about to show you? Uh, right now, if I export it, it's gonna say exporting with a watermark. All right, so. And then it's going to export, and then there's going to be anno these annoying demo mod, uh, mode, as you see in my previous videos. There's a way to bypass that. And this is how, this is what you need to do. Um, first off, you need to paste, actually, you know what, you just, you can delete that. Uh, you could need to, you know, select that and drag your video down to the right corner or this corner but away from the center because the center is that's where the demo mod uh, watermark is going to be located at um, I like to put mine like this and then uh, a little less than a one-fourth of the screen after when you export you want to go to preset see how it says on web high well um, Mm, you know, <laughs> web high. It's the, technically it's supposed to be the the, um, the 720p HD. It's supposed to be HD, but it really it is not. So what you want to do is you want to go to manage. If you haven't done this already, I've already have. See, I have ultra. That's not how you spell ultra. Um, uh, 180 and 780p HD. Uh, what you want to do is you want to copy this right here. And see how it says you just gotta name it whatever you want. Uh, okay, uh, YouTube test thingy. All right, and then just click out of the box, and then click on edit. You're gonna have to. You want to leave everything the frames per second profile to main. Uh, everything is gonna be the same except for the duration. Uh, that that data rate data rate that I can't read. <laughs> data rate. Okay. Um, for um. For 180, for 180 um, files, 180, what, fuck. 180 files, you're gonna want to put 5,000. All right. Um, but you see how I have that YouTube 180 Ultra? That's because I think I have like 25,000, but it doesn't change the videos. Um, it doesn't change the videos anything. So. You want to click OK after you've done, you've saved it and everything. It saves automatically. Then you want to go to preset and select the one. See, I got, I got the ultra, which is oh, it's 55. I thought it was 25. See, I got um, 55, whatever that is per second, uh, k bytes. Um, and after you want to go to the scale size. I usually do that um, one to uh, 1280 by uh, 720. Because, I don't know, it's just, I don't know, it's, it, it exports faster, but you could do 180, or you could do whatever, uh, you could do uh, 180, uh, but I recommend leaving it, leaving the width to this, 
which is this, and it's just changing this to um, 720 or 180. After that, you just uh, export it. Uh, yeah, replace it for the old one. And click uh, yes with the watermark. And as you can see, it's, it'll, it'll, be, it'll export. Uh, it'll take under a minute. And it's right here, but it's not done exporting. Uh, I'll show you. All right, when it's done exporting, uh, you can close this out or you cannot close it out, whatever you want. Uh, but then you go on it and see how it's like, uh, see how it's not even in the screen anymore. Um, <laughs> um, if, uh, if you have, see how like my background is like all really dark here, so you can't really see the border of the thing, you might want to have, you might want to, uh, figure that, figure a way to see f your full on border of your whole video, YouTube video, because afterwards you have successfully exported with that, then you want to go to your, um, video editing software, alright, I use, um, a Final Cut Pro, whoops, why does it say, oh, never mind. I uh, use Final Cut Pro da -da 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 screen. Um, then you just gotta, you know, just take that in there. Then you gotta right click, or you could just go to that right here. It's the same thing. I don't know. I like right click. You gotta go to crop, and then just crop this out. Crap it out. No, crop it. Uh, then you gotta transform. Transformation. And then you got a nice video without um, that annoying pet. Whoops. Uh, see, look. Now you got that a nice video uh, without the annoying words on it. And then you just got to export it. All right, so once it, once it exports, um, see how the quality is just horrible? Um, it's like all really just horrible. Oh, look at this pretty good old. <sighs> Bitch, I saw that. <laughs> um, the quality is horrible. Uh, you could just, uh, if you have, if you, this is for Mac basically. Uh, you could just go to uh, 20, uh, 720p. Um, and yeah. Just uh, then. It's gonna change. It's also once you when you upload it to YouTube, it's also gonna take a lot less if it's at 2080, uh, 720. Um, it's gonna take a lot less. And well, you know the quality sucks. Um, but if you um export if you uh export it into your video editing software as a 1080p and then export it out as a 1080p and then change it to a 780p, um, or 720p, it the quality uh, changes to be much much better. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope this video was very useful. Um, I also remember um, as of July 6th, I may not be uploading videos uh, as much, I guess. I'll lose internet connection, so please don't unsubscribe. Um, and thanks, thank you for your support. I really appreciate it. Bye!